So in this video, we're going to talk about circumscribed angles to a circle. Um, but before we do, I want to real quick refresh on central angles and inscribed angles. So remember, a central angle is exactly what the arc measure is. So like, let's say this angle right here, the central angle is 90, then the arc itself is also 90 degrees. We measure arcs by the central angle. An inscribed angle, which is its vertex is on the circle, those are always half the arc or half the central angle. So in this case, it would be 45 degrees. But now we're going to talk about one final type of angle that has to do with circles, and they're called circumscribed angles. So inscribed angles are inside the circle. Circumscribed means kind of outside, like kind of like hugging it. Almost looks like an ice cream cone, which is kind of fun. It's an angle that's formed by two tangent lines. Um, and so this would be a circumscribed circle, or a circumscribed angle, and this is a circumscribed angle. Um, just as a reminder, tangent lines are lines that literally just barely touch the circle once and then go on their way. Tangent comes from uh, the Latin word tangier, which means to touch. So it touches it at one point and it forms a 90 degree angle with one of the circles radii. So that would be a 90 degree angle right there, or even if it's tangent right here, then it would just be 90 degrees with that radius. So keep that in mind as we talk about circumscribed angles. See, it looks like an ice cream cone. It, so there are only two tangent lines we could draw to the circle from this point. We could draw a line like on this side of the circle, and on this side of the circle, and there's no other tangent lines I could actually draw. So, um, a circumscribed angle, the way we find it, is it always adds up to 180 with the central angle. So basically, these two add up to 180, they're supplementary. If this is 165, then this is gonna be 15 because that's 180 minus 165. Um, keep in mind that means that the circumscribed angle and the arc that it touches are also going to be supplementary because if that's 165, this is also 165. So these two should also add up to 180. Um, let's talk about the reason for this. Why is that the case? The reason is because of the whole 90 degree angle thing. So remember, this tangent line should form a 90 degree angle with the circle's radius. And this tangent line is also going to form a 90 degree angle with the radius. So a f what I've just formed is a quadrilateral, like the central angle combined with this circumscribed angle forms this wonky looking quadrilateral where I already know that this is 90 and this is 90. Just as a refresher, a quadrilateral has 360 total degrees. So if you take that three, whoops, if you take that 360 and subtract the two 90s that you already know you have, you're left with 180. So that's why. I don't know exactly what these two are, but I know they have to add up to 180 because 180 plus 180 would be 360. All right, so for example, what's the measure of angle X? All I need to do is these two should add up to 360, sorry, 180. So just do 180 minus 110. Oh goodness, I'm struggling today. And you would get 70. Just to be clear, that's because this arc here is the same as the central angle, so it's 110, and then these two also should add up to 180. All right, now let's talk about the connection between all three of these types of angles. I am not able to jump directly from the inscribed angle to the circumscribed angle. I don't know what that relationship is, but I do know inscribed to central is doubled, so make that a 60. And then I know that these two add up to 180. So do 180 minus 60 and you get 120 for this angle here. 
and that's my answer. So it's really important when we talk about circles to be able to go between these three angles. They're the, probably the most important that we talk about with circles. Central angles, inscribed angles, and now circumscribed angles. Um, so again, this is kind of like the big three. You've got um, inscribed, central, and circumscribed. And they kind of all connect to each other.